uh, Amadeus is not an objective documentary biography of Wolfgang Mozart. Uh, for a start, he never called himself Amadeus. Um, he signed himself when he did Amade, which isn't, you know, it's a French version of it. Uh, and a lot of people who criticize the play on that level appear never to have had a fiction. I would stand by a lot of the details of the play, not actually the giggle, which now irritates me, and I sort of regret it. I, don't, I, I think it's used too much. Um, and I've taken it out of the printed version, actually, of the, of the play. Um, because it's li liable to be misused and made too much of. Uh, but the scatology is true, and a lot of it I got from, or the idea of it from reading his letters, particularly to his cousin, Anna Maria Tecla. Uh, and I figure if a guy writes uh, scatology, his conversation must be fairly scatological too. Perhaps not the other way around, but certainly that way, I think. It's a, fa a fairly safe assumption. Uh, and a lot of people don't, in the 19th century, for example, could not accept the idea of a man writing that ineffable music, that, say, the slow movement of the clarinet concerto, who also is telling fart jokes. But I mean, I find that is the great paradox that excites a dramatist, that sort of thing. Part of him was uh, very infantile. He was. Uh, held back, I think, a lot of in his development by his father. He wrote a lot of letters to his father which are either conceal or evade the truth, have the, the force not exactly of lying but of doctored truth, because he was frightened of his father, I think, and always wanted to please him too much. Although he did defy him in the end and marry the girl that Leopold didn't want him to marry. And all of that is true. Uh, his addiction to billiards and dancing was true, his, his dressing up was true, his but you see, he didn't, it's amazing that he had any time to do anything but write, because the outpouring of music is so vast. And the wonder is not only the, uh, that it's so prolific, but that it is so perfect um, once he got started. I think Mozart's, apart from one or two works written in Salzburg, his, his uh, greatness begins with his arrival in Vienna in the 10 years 1781 to 1791, when he just writes one masterpiece after another.